images of the Sichuan earthquake in China and of the Nargis cyclone in Myanmar will remain with us for a long time. Other large-scale disasters like the Indian Ocean tsunami, Hurricane Katrina and the Kashmir earthquake have marked the past few years. Disasters of different origin and various types are increasing in terms of frequency, complexity, scope and destructive capacity. The time has come for a major conceptual shift from post-disaster reaction to an emphasis on pre-disaster action. Disaster reduction is possible and is cost effective. The progress in scientific knowledge and technological know-how makes it increasingly possible to prevent and mitigate the effects of disaster. Every dollar invested in prevention reduces by up to ten dollars the losses incurred in the event of natural disasters. We must stimulate opportunities for learning and sharing appropriate lessons that may help individuals, communities and whole societies to be better prepared for disasters. We must promote integrated approaches in addressing the issue of disasters. This is what the International Disaster and Risk Conference Davos 2008 is about. The conference is therefore timely. It is a most welcome event. UNESCO, the United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization is proud to be associated with IDRC Davos 2008. May I also commend my good friend Walter Amann and his team members for their efforts in arranging and offering such an outstanding meeting in such a wonderful venue.